Hello everybody, Cole here, and today we are filling a thunderstorm. And if you guys do not know me, do not know me personally, then I then I will inform you guys that I am very, very into weather and and uh, meteor meteorology. Believe it, meteorological. I don't think I said that right. Uh, I wanted to have a profession in meteorology, but uh, th that's only a dream of mine. I would like to be a storm chaser also. That was a pretty bright strike. And also, I'm breaking. Yes. And I am breaking a uh, ma major rule of weather. Uh, do not get near any doors or windows or screens at this when, during a severe thunderstorm, which is currently happening, guys. So, um, I really like lightning, and I am personally, I will admit it, I get very nervous in the thunderstorms, but uh, I, I really love them, guys. I, I Every time there's a thunderstorm, which is... Uh, this thunderstorm currently has only been going on for a, for a few minutes, but it is so far the worst thunderstorm that's happened all summer or even this year. Uh, and actually, here comes uh, I'm not going to say his name, but so somebody that I know, uh, essentially. And um, I'm just going to film this uh, the thunder and lightning storm, and uh, yeah, I really hope you guys enjoy it quite a bit. And all right, so yeah, guys. Uh, I'm just gonna let you guys and enjoy this. Uh, it's actually raining inside my house right now because this is actually a screen, so you guys can actually hear thunder. All right, guys. Oh man. I think I hope I got that on video. Hey, Roy, so you're gonna be on YouTube? Right. Well, I'm using it for like light for my YouTube video here. So yeah, yeah, guys. I uh. I uh. Really uh, like weather, so I hope you guys enjoy this video. It might be a little bit longer of a video because this uh, storm is going to be, and this this storm might last for a little bit. But um, this uh, this is gonna be huge thunder. Ready? Where's the thunder? Come on, thunder! Come on! I need to hear you. Big clap. You can hear it rolling. All right, so you guys look, looking at the road or whatever and noticing, well, it's not really raining that hard. It's actually not raining hard at all. It's just a regular maybe rain after that. And, oh, there you go. The reason why I'm so fascinated with this particular storm is because there's a lot of lightning and thunder in it. And uh, I personally like thunder and lightning. Uh, not so much for the rain that leaves a big aftermath, but uh, the thunder and lightning I really like. And if you guys have been on this channel for a little bit at least, for like the past year maybe, but you guys do see some, uh, I think it was maybe two videos that I had Thunder and Lightning on. Possibly three. Actually, no, two. And, uh, yeah, it, uh, I, I really enjoy these, as you guys could probably tell. I just keep gabbing at the gums at, holy, yabbing at the gums. I think I said that right. Did I say that right? I don't know. I don't really care. I like thunderstorms. Kind of stumbling over my, over my words here, but yeah. So you guys down real quick, and uh, so you guys can enjoy the show. So now guys, as you guys should probably tell, the storm is about directly over us. And the, the way that I know that is, is that it's thundering and lightning at the exact same time. And therefore, uh, I have a pretty good idea that the uh, storm is almost directly on top of us. And uh, I'm pointing up here at the sky, and there's a screen here protecting us. So I need to worry about me walking out by accident and just getting struck by lightning. Even though that would probably make a pretty good YouTube video, but we get a lot of likes on that. Yeah, I don't know if you guys can see it. That's water right here. As you can see, you can kind of see the screen right here. There's water dripping from my roof. And, uh, yeah, that, that's the car I just pulled in, by the way. And, uh, yeah, guys, I'm going to have to break this into a few parts. Uh, yeah.
Yeah, guys, I actually enjoy YouTube videos that involve thunder and lightning. And whoa, that just came bright as day. Listen. Oh yeah, that, that was a good one. I saw the uh, loud lightning. And, uh, wow, I saw the loud lightning. I'm English much today, but I saw the bright lightning. Oh, there we might have another rumble right here. But uh, I saw the bright lightning and. I'm not sure if this is true or not. This is just a hypothesis of mine. I have not searched this up, I, even though I probably should. But if you guys do know anything any more about weather than I do, which I know quite a bit, not to brag, I'm not bragging at all. There's obviously more people that know much more about weather than I do. I'm just a simple amateur. Uh, that knows up. Just a little bit. Wow. Ooh. That scared me a little bit, I can't lie. No, but I, do, I know a little bit about weather. Probably a little bit more than most at the, than the average teenager, but I bet there's I'm hundred percent sure that there's more teenage there's teenagers out there that know much much more than I do. But I, I, I every time I see really bright lightning, it always results in a loud rumble of thunder. Kind of the same thing that I found out with fireworks. Like that uh, when I watch fireworks, only the, the white ones that pop real quick are the ones that are super loud. And uh, that's why I think about like maybe lightning and thunder. The, the, the lightning that's, uh, cause normally lightning comes before thunder. And, uh, we might have a big rumble here, guys. But, uh, that, the brighter the lightning, possibly maybe, uh, heavier the rumble of thunder. I, I'm not 100% sure about that. But, uh, yeah, it'd be pretty cool if I'm right. That, that, I, that's something I have to research myself. And if any viewers watching this, they search it, research it on their own and, Tell me about it, that would be fantastic, even though I will end up researching it after this video. But yeah, guys, uh, the camera's a little shaky. Uh, I kind of have a valid reason for that. No, I'm gonna make it darker if the lightning will pop more. Yeah, this make it look more, uh, this make it look more, uh, scary. I kind of repeated myself there. I want to set this down and see if it makes the lightning pop more. No, it's not really making the lightning pop more. I'm gonna keep it right here, guys. And that was a pretty bright strike there. And guys, oddly enough, there actually is a video on my YouTube channel of me standing in this in this exact spot, almost getting struck by lightning. So I'm gonna demonstrate what happened. So I was doing almost the exact same thing that I'm doing right now. I was recording the lightning and thunder, right? And right over here, like right here in this area, completely missed all the trees because that tree, oh, well, there's a little gap, like maybe right here. The lightning went down and struck right there. Like right in this area. I don't know if you can see it, but there's like a little brown mark that may possibly be where it's from, but uh, it's probably been there for a, quite a long time. But uh, that's a lightning struck right there, right here on the lawn. And um, there, there is a video on my YouTube channel me standing in this exact spot, I'm like, yeah, there's lightning and thunder, and then a bolt just goes bang, and then lands right there and scares the crap out of me. And I, walk back in my house, which I'm not really going to show right now. Guys, I'm just going to other videos on my YouTube channel and TV inside of my house. <laughs> but yeah, guys, that, that's pretty much what I'm doing right now, is recording the thunder and lightning. And now it's actually starting to heavily rain, which is what I was hoping for. Um, right, falling, right in front of the camera is water that's falling profusely off the top of my house. And there's a Hummer. Those actually, Hummers hydroplane pretty bad in the water, so... If you're going fast enough, it is. I already found something very interesting. What is that? I'm not sure if that's from like the tree up there blocking the thing. 
but right there, the black spot. I'm not 100% sure what that is. He's actually going slow like you're supposed to be. Oh yeah. This is some very good weather conditions. I'm actually very proud of myself for pulling out my camera and recording this because I'd be sorry if I didn't. And also, I live in an area where we get a lot of snow, so I'm, this this winter, I'm going to get a nice case on my phone, possibly even do up my GoPro, and have videos of me in the snow, right? Like, I, I already have videos like that on my YouTube channel of me out in the snow. Wait, do I? I don't think I had a video of the night video, because that was too long to put on my YouTube channel. But, uh, yeah, yeah, I, I be get messed with the snow. And, uh, and we have to get a lot of snow and rain up here. Oh, he was flying. But, uh, these people are very cautious drivers, because in this area, we actually get a lot of rain and snow, and like the summertime we get a lot of rain, and the wintertime we actually get a lot of snow. So people are very cautious drivers, and they're going to be driving this slow. This is a 30 mile an hour road, and they're driving like 25 to 30, 25 to 20 miles an hour. And that's a big thing for us, for uh, up here and where I live at. L look at this corn husk, it's getting battered. But yeah, guys, I, this is only getting to the good parts. So, what I am, that's a big truck. You can like see the, these splash marks coming out from under the tires. I think it's very, very cool to watch. But this video is actually getting quite long. So what I'm going to do is, I'm gonna split this into maybe one or two, or possibly three videos of that if it has to go down to it. So, uh, yeah guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Just click on the next video on my YouTube channel and you'll catch the second version of this. So until next time guys, it's a closer dude and I will see you guys. In